What is going on everybody? Happy Monday. Today is March 18th. Yesterday was Christmas Day for college basketball fans. Selection Sunday. And with that, here's the picks. All right, guys. So here we go with the picks. First up, UConn Stetson. Sorry, sorry to the Cowboy Hats, but UConn moving on. FAU Northwestern. Uh, darlings of last year's tournament, but going with Chris Collins since he's a Duke guy to move on. San Diego State, UAB. San Diego State was another Final Four team last year. I just, I, I'm, I've, I've got an East Coast bias, I guess. I'm going UAB. Auburn, Yale. Bruce Pearl has them guys playing very well. BYU, Duquesne. BYU, Illinois, Moorhead State. Uh, the Illini are playing very well. Washington State, Drake, toss-up, don't care either way, doesn't matter because they're going to get destroyed by Iowa State the next game. Move on down to the West. We got everyone's hated or beloved North Carolina Tar Heels, Mississippi State. Michigan State should not be in, by the way. That's the biggest travesty of this entire tournament. The fact that they got in, they got in on name alone, and just for views, they do not deserve to be in this tournament. St. Mary, Grand Canyon, going with Grand Canyon. Alabama, Charleston, Bama Rolls, Clemson, New Mexico. <laughs> Got to go with the ACC, although Clemson, yeah, they I can't let you down a lot. Uh, Baylor, Colgate, Baylor's a good team. Dayton, Nevada, Dayton's also a good team. Arizona, Long Beach State, Arizona is a really good team. Let's go on over and see the South. So South region. We got Houston Longwood. Houston rolls on. Nebraska, Texas A&M. This is going to be a very good first round game. Um, uh, this this is a struggle. I, I, think, I think Nebraska shoots the ball well enough to move on. Wisconsin, James Madison. James Madison is a very trendy pick. That's why I'm going with Wisconsin. Duke, Vermont, no question. It's going to be Duke. Texas Tech, NC State. NC State is on an absolute tear of a roll. Um, they, what they just did in the ACC tournament is impressive. And they're going to do one of two things. They're going to keep it going and do really well in this tournament. Or they're going to lay an egg in the first round. But I think they got it going on. Kentucky, that offense is too much. Moving on. Florida, Boise, or Colorado. Uh, we're going to go Florida, but if Colorado wins this, um, Colorado's got a great chance to beat them. Marquette, Western Kentucky, we're going to go with Marquette. Midwest, Purdue lost last year to a 16 seed, not going to happen again. TCU, Utah State, TCU, Gonzaga, McNeese. McNeese is very good, actually. Um, that's going to be a very trendy upset pick. And you know what? We're going to do it just because. Kansas, Sanford. Kansas is not very good this year. I'm going with Sanford. South Carolina, Oregon, and Sanford as a SOCON team. Same as Western Carolina, which uh, go Cats. So we're going with Sanford. South Carolina, Oregon. South Carolina looks pretty good. Creighton, Akron. Creighton looks pretty good. Texas versus UVA or uh, whoever that is. Colorado State, I was thinking. Virginia isn't just... Uh, I want to pick Virginia. I really do because of the ACC, but... I don't think it's going to happen. So, Tennessee St. Peter's. Tennessee is a very, very strong team. All right. Go back up here. UConn Northwestern. Northwestern can give them a game. Are they going to? I don't know. But UConn is a very tough. We're going to go UConn. Auburn is going to destroy UAB. Illinois, BYU, Illini for the win. Iowa State for the win. It's not even going to be close right there. North Carolina, Mississippi State. I can see Mississippi State beating North Carolina, but I'm not going to take it. That should be an upset alert possible right there because that, that's a good matchup, even though North Carolina is, is the stronger team. Grand Canyon, Alabama, roll tight again. Clemson, Baylor, I would take Clemson in a heartbeat. If they play their potential, Clemson would win this game. I don't think they're going to. I don't think the coaching's there, so we're going Baylor. Dayton, Arizona, I really like this Dayton team. However, Arizona is just on another level, I think. And we'll talk about a reason that's they're going to keep moving on here in a minute. All right, back to the other side here. 
we've got Houston, Nebraska. Uh, I'm going to Nebraska. I think this winner here is beating Houston here, no matter what. I think Houston's the first one out. I think they're weak. I think they showed they're weak. They play in the weak conference. Everybody claims their conference is super strong in Big 12, but I'm sorry, a Big 12 with Kansas as bad as they were this year is not a good Big 12. Nebraska, take it out, Houston. Wisconsin, Duke. Duke rolls on in the Sweet 16. NC State, Kentucky. This would be a very entertaining game. Uh, but I think DJ Burns beats them down low. Florida Marquette. This Marquette team is really not that good to me. But Florida is... This is a tough one. This is a tough one. But I'm going to go Marquette just because of the seed line. Although I could really see the other way. All right. We are down to the Elite no, we're not. We're in the Sweet 16. Sorry. UConn-Auburn. Auburn's going to take it. Bruce Pearl, like I said, has that team playing very well. Illinois. Iowa State. Illinois. North Carolina. Alabama. North Carolina. Baylor. Arizona. Arizona. Back up top here. We've got Duke, Nebraska. Duke goes to the Elite Eight. NC State Marquette. NC State's going to pull another stunner. And give us another little rematch here. Purdue, Texas, Christian. I just missed this whole bracket the last time, didn't I? It looks like. Okay. Purdue, TCU. Purdue. McNeese, Sanford. Sanford. South Carolina, Creighton. South Carolina. Tennessee, Texas. Rick Barnes game. Tennessee rolls. Tennessee over South Carolina. Purdue over Sanford. So we now have our Elite Eight ready to go. Our Elite Eight is ready to go. And in that Elite Eight, we have Auburn, Illinois on this side. Bruce Pearl's just better. I'm going the Pearl. This is the game the tournament wants more than anything in the entire world. They set it up for this. They're going to ensure that it happens. And North Carolina is a really good team, and I could easily have them win the national championship. But I think, I think Arizona takes it if it comes down to that. Duke, NC State. I'm going to stick with the homer pick and go with my Blue Devils over NC State to advance to the Final Four. Lastly, here at Tennessee, and and I will say. If it wasn't for coaching, Tennessee would win the national championship. I think they're the best team in the nation talent-wise, what they put on the court. But Rick Barnes just Rick Barnes too much. Um, so this is just – this this probably won't happen. But I'm going to go with it right now. Auburn, Arizona, too much. Auburn. I really like this Auburn team. I really do. Duke, Tennessee, a rematch of last year's uh, – Round of 32 game that Tennessee knocked out Duke. Guess what? We get our revenge. And we've got two four seasons in the National Championship. And it's going to be a barn burner. But it's going to be amazing because Duke's going to come out on top. Total combined points scored. It's going to be a lot. We're going to go with uh, 162 points, my guy. And we got Duke winning the men's national championship. Yeah, woo!